Yeah. Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. 315 Mompfire here to tell you that education is very important. Let's talk about sneakers. It's the Rap Diablo. Macho when I drop flows. The bar gets raised up. It's me and Petey Pablo. Colder than Gaspacho. Colder than the mono. Rapping head honcho, rocking shows like I was Bono. What's up, guys? 315 Mompfire. Back at you with another video. Today, we're going to be showing y'all the test of Priceless workout. And as you can see right here, uh, you can pause it there and read it. But again, it'll be in the description just like the last video. Uh, and then for this exercise, all you're going to need is a backpack, some books or anything that you can put in it to make it heavy, uh, and two chairs. Uh, anything like this works, or if you have like couches or anything like that, that'll work too. Or if you can have furniture that's like at the same height, you can use that too. And you just have to like uh, change it a little bit so that you can do it. Um, the first exercise that we're going to start with is a, it's like a makeshift bench. What you're going to do is you're going to get your backpack with your weights or your books or whatever inside. <coughs> you're going to lay on your back and you're going to have a limited uh, range of motion because of the floor obviously. So if you can lay on something that's kind of like a bench, that would be beneficial, but if not, you can still do this exercise. <coughs> so you'll hold it, just make sure that the weight is balanced throughout the backpack. And you go. And you push it up. Down. Push up. Okay, the next exercise is going to be a tricep extension, and again, you're going to use your backpack. For this one, you can choose to do it while you're standing up or sitting down on something, and I'll do it sitting down just to show you guys. <laughs> so it's going to be just as if you had a dumbbell. You're going to grab it from the, uh, the little handle on top, go down, and then extend all the way up. Go down, extend all the way up. Okay, after that, you're gonna do a dip, and this is what you're gonna need your, your two pieces of furniture or whatever for. So you're gonna put them like this. I would recommend putting something on each or having somebody step on them so that it doesn't move. So right now I'm gonna put some weights on it. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna grab each, each side of the chair and you're just gonna perform a dip. And again, if you want to make it harder, you can throw on your backpack behind you and it'll add extra weight. Okay, this next exercise is called a push away. You're going to want a piece of furniture that's like, uh, like at your stomach level or at your chest level. Anything like from here to here really works. What you're gonna do is you're gonna step away from it, just stand like on your tippy toes, hold on like this, and let yourself fall forward. Like this, and then you're gonna push away using your triceps. Try to let all your weight fall and not use your legs, just use your triceps to push. It's gonna be a variation of like a low fly. Uh, so again, you need your backpack with your weights. You'll grab it like this. Try to keep your palms facing upward as much as you can. It's kind of difficult because of the way the backpack is. Or you can do it like this if you prefer. And then you're just gonna keep your arms straight as you're pushing up. This one is the kickback. Again, you need your backpack. This one, you, you should hold it at the top. So you're gonna do like this, and then extend. And you're gonna wanna do that for each arm. This last one is gonna be a burnout, and I would recommend you get like a t-shirt or a towel or something, because for part of it, you're gonna uh, do push-ups, but on the last set, you're going to do them on your knees. So this is so that your knees don't hurt if you don't have carpet or something like that. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I'm tired. Don't. 
Okay, okay so what you're gonna do is the first set, you're gonna do push ups as best as you can until failure. And then after you fail on those push ups, then you're able to your knees and you keep doing them until failure. Okay, so let's say on that one I failed, then I would immediately move to knees and I would keep going. And you keep doing that until you fail again. Okay, and after that, like I said on my last video, I like to do abs every day or every other day. It's good so that you keep your abs toned. Yeah, so for each of these exercises, I do three sets and then I do 15, 12, 10. If you find that 15 is too easy, I would just keep going 15, 15, 15, but you can accommodate it to whatever your level is. Um, and, and yeah, you'll get a good pump from this workout. My friend actually asked me if the other one was like good, you get a good pump, and yeah, you do. As long as you put enough weight on the backpack and you put it uh, accommodating to yourself, you'll get a good workout. Okay, so that was the chest and triceps workout. Uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Have a good day, good night, good evening, whatever you're doing, whatever time you're watching.